Yo, welcome back to the channel, guys. It's me, Blessed, and today we're going to be playing with crossplay disable for the Xbox. And I know a lot of you people have been like wondering and on Twitter and TikTok how you guys can turn off crossplay. I normally do this every year when it comes to betas and multiplayer, so you guys can have that better console experience as console players in here. And I want to go ahead and show you guys step by step. You guys can play this game with crossplay disable. And I've been enjoying this beta, Black Ops Six betas. Of crossplay being disabled it's probably the best thing i've done in quite a quite a while especially for multiplayer games and let's go ahead and dive into it though so make sure you guys stay tuned to this step-by-step -step tutorial so what you guys want to do you guys want to go into you know close out call of duty completely until you're on the main home screen you guys are going to go into your settings you're going to click on settings right here where it says account you're going to go to scroll down to privacy and online safety then you're going to go to xbox privacy scroll down to where it says view details and customize and then communication and multiplayer right and then right here where it says you can join cross network play you're going to see where it says allow or block you're going to want to hit block because this will disable playstation and pc from your games when you're playing multiplayer this does not work for uh, warzone i've already tried this before so i highly don't recommend trying because you're just going to sit there looking crazy looking for a match it's not possible i mean i could be wrong let me know in the comments but to me I tried this before. I could never find a lobby with this Xbox players in a Warzone match, but I wanted to go, you know, just show you guys right here in this video. Um, let's go ahead and get out of this. So once you guys can uh, finish that, you're gonna want to go into Call of Duty once again. So we're gonna go ahead and show you guys when we get there. Once you guys get to this screen right here, basically it's gonna say you cannot play with people outside of Xbox because of how your account is set up. Do not hit okay, because if you hit okay, it's going to enable your crossplay once again. And you're going to be playing with playstation and pc players you will get this message every time you boot up this game which is quite of annoying but at the same time i don't really mind it so i hit cancel every single time so make sure you guys hit cancel you're going to get this message twice now that we're playing the the black, uh, black ops 6 beta do not hit warzone you can do this in multi, multi uh you can do this in modern warfare 3 multiplayer it will work there but it just doesn't work for battle royales unfortunately but you're going to click on the black ops 6 beta and once you guys load up to Black Ops 6 Beta, you're gonna get this message once again, which is, again, it is kind of annoying, but it is effective, chat. I've done, I've done this before for a couple of years, and a lot of people has been appreciating this video or types of videos like this, so I hope you guys enjoy this gameplay and video as well as we play the Black Ops 6 Beta together. To me, I've been enjoying the Black Ops 6 Beta since it's dropped, and as you guys can see here, I got the exact same message as before just hit cancel and you guys are good to go to play this game and to me it feels like the games are a lot more effective you can load up to matches very quickly just from the beta being you know free for most players this upcoming weekend so i hope you guys take advantage of this so let's go ahead and hop into some gameplay dude look how fast you guys load up into a match of black Ops 6 beta by the way this is just the beta not the full release the full release launches on october 25th if you guys have been living under a rock but ever since that i we've you know realize that you guys can turn off crossplay i think that's huge for most players in here because most of us xbox players don't really want to be a part of crossplay whether they want to play with playstation or pc but for us i'm i'm kind i'm really happy that this is a thing that you can actually still play with your own your own uh oh god i don't know man what let me know in the comments what you guys think about this i hope you guys enjoy or enjoying this type of type of play style and content because i do want to make videos for xbox and stuff like that kinda... see this jackal can kind of reach at all different ranges though which is insane so i kind of understand why people have been using it excuse me i didn't even get like a kill cam he's just like instantly annihilated me there trying to get used to it though like i said i know you normally kind of pair up with players that are kind of like don't understand the game itself and then there's a lot of players in here that don't really uh you kind of have to like play with a team if you're playing black ops 6 as of right now even when the game fully releases because everyone's going to be sweating everyone's prepping for warzone which is kind of annoying but hopefully we'll see like you know 
everyone who actually enjoys multiplayer for the multiplayer and not just warzone itself but who knows man i, I kind of want multiplayer to you know take the icing on the cake this year i know i'm kind of sitting here right now. my guy was not happy there kind of helped my teammate hell here kind of holding down the spot right here Am I being followed? Mission timeline expired. UAV. Oh, we got a chopper gunner? Didn't even realize that. Heck yeah, dude. I know we're kind of like laying back, chilling. I'm trying to have my moment here. Kind of have my moment here, man. I normally don't get, I really don't do this well right now because I'm playing solos. And if you're not playing like with a team base, you're kind of going to get fried though because most people are going to be in a six man party every single time. But I'm getting lucky right now. I don't know. Maybe these guys are random themselves. We'll see. I kind of just like well, that was timing honestly cod timing itself as soon as I turn my back though that's when he popped out so we can help our teammates here yeah man this jackal if you haven't played with this jackal man this just this SMG is way too powerful maybe a tad bit good but I don't think they should nerf it though they should probably uh, bo boost mo more guns into the mix. I think that'd be great. I don't think they should nerf this SMG, so definitely nerf or buff most weapons in this game just to like kind of even it out a little bit. But who knows, dude? We know Treyarch though. They they or Call of Duty themselves normally like allow a weapon to be overpowered, which that's been the most case for most CODs these days. Most most uh, some weapons will be better than others. Makes makes total sense oh my god we kind of world start that guy let me know if you guys want to like more of these commentary videos by the way i've been trying to get better at making commentaries and just talking about the game how i feel about it this is like my initial thoughts of what i think about this bo6 beta so far but i don't think anyone wants to play the objective right now it isn't a terrible spot though, so I don't blame people for not wanting to play it. Hey, off the I think I'm gonna go down here. All on this pulse UAV. Scout pulse. Kind of reminds me of the uh, the satcom from Ghost, but instead of hiding it, you can just call it, and it's like your own personal little UAV. Kind of pop this UAV if I can. UAV commencing surveillance operation. I don't think why. Go ahead and cap this thing so we can increase our lead. It's good shots, my dude. Good shots. UAV mission timeline 50% expanded. Enemy should be rolling up on us, right? Right through this door. Elevator. Oh, they, <laughs> I was just about to get shot in the back. Shout out to that garage. They should be coming through this door. This is the only way. There's like three ways you can come up here, but they should be coming out right about now. Either that or just rotating already. But yeah, man, let me know. Um, I want to make more commentary videos. I want to, you know, help xbox players in general are uh, having a great gaming experience especially uh especially you guys man most players nowadays like the console players still fill up most of the player base uh when it comes to call of duty so and i do want to keep the console community alive whether you're on playstation or you're on xbox or whatnot 
and I do want to like just continue to make content, especially for us like that, because I think most players are moving the PC because of the frame rate, which is completely understandable. But we all know there is that old school gamer who still prefer to be on a console. So, and I'm one of those guys, by the way. I'm not gonna lie, I thought that guy was dead. But the lobbies don't feel as I wouldn't, you know, I take those with a grain of salt though. I don't think these lobbies are gonna be uh easier so keep that in mind because xbox players are still very sweaty play, sweaty players so i think the lobbies feel the same even if you're playing with crossplay enabled they're going to be just as sweaty so keep that in mind for sure to be honest i didn't even think he pushed up i'll be honest yeah most players do not take take that with a grain of salt. These player these lobbies are not as easy as people think they will be with cross play cross play disabled. Xbox players are probably the sweatiest players in the pool. I have to be real with y'all. I'm gonna pop this. I really don't use these as often, so. Nice little triple kill there. Hard point active. Hard point is secure. Hostile UAV established overhead. No. There's so many different footstep cues. I couldn't tell which direction they were coming from. <laughs> oh, this is great though. It feels great though, man. I kind of feel like an old school player kind of playing on my own lobbies like I used to because I've been playing Call of Duty for nearly 20 years. So it's it does feel good to at least have I can play with like my own my own brand, my own console, my own uh, my own platform as well. So it does it does amaze me. I, I mean, I hopefully we'll see this. Hopefully this word this video will be, you know, will do well. We can like spread the word. I know most people are playing on crossplay this uh, enable, but Hey, if this video can be amazing, that'd be great. If we can drop maybe 10 likes on this video. That'd be amazing for me. That'd be amazing for this community. Even more, you know? I want to see Call of Duty shine again, especially for console. There's a guy right there camping. Hopefully this grenade would hit him. I'm kind of just going to wrap up points here. Should be spawning right next to me, right? Here, I'm gonna close this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna close this just so I can like, kind of like, keep an eye on the area. I hear them close. Oh nope, I think we're pretty good here, chat. As I say that, and I almost get killed, and at, now they pop up. That's wild. Hey, we'll take it though. Like I said, these lobbies are pretty fast, like. I will not take this as a, you know, I would not take advantage of this thinking that you're going to get easy lobbies because you're not because there's a lot of sweaty pl players with crossplay disabled. I would definitely take advantage of playing with your own platform though, 100%. I would probably prefer crossplay disabled. I've been wanting that since, you know, Modern Warfare 2, honestly, maybe even Cold War. But dude, I'm I'm you know loving this whole Omni movement. I'm loving this crossplay disable. I'm loving that lobbies are, you know, loading up faster. I'm just like everything about this is a huge win for me. So yeah, um, that's gonna wrap it up for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this gameplay with crossplay being disabled. Um, hopefully you guys can take advantage of this as well because I want you guys to be, have the experience that you guys deserve, especially on uh, console or or PlayStation. I know PlayStation has a button that you can literally turn it off just from the settings, but Xbox has to go through a little bit more settings to get it done, but it can work. But let me go. Let me guys know what you think in the comments. Should I make more videos with crossplay disabled? But other than that, I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend and enjoy the beta. Have a good day.